super hard and stiff like some house shoes are when you get them love these they only last i would say about two months so hey you get what you get for them they were originally eight dollars i paid 663 for them with the coupon i did get these in a size large um i wear about an eight and a half nine so these are perfect if you're in that size range yeah, if you see me looking over here, it's because I got a new camera and the, the screen is over here, so don't mind me, okay? So the next thing I got was some undergarments or whatever. Comes in this Shein bag like most of the clothing does. Everything comes in its own individual baggie. So it's really just like a body shaper, but I couldn't really try it on because of this. It has the open crotch area here. So I guess if you, you know, you gotta make a mad dash to the bathroom, they got you covered, okay? You don't even have to take it off, you just sit down and squat, whatever you need to do. So it is really, really conforming. So I got this in a size medium, and it fits perfectly. It has a zipper, but underneath the zipper, it has the hook and eye closure, so you hook it up, it's like four of them. Zip it up and it comes under your boob area. It does have straps. The straps are removable, so you can take them off if you need to. And it is short, and it has like lace at the bottom of them. The only thing I, I really don't like about it is that the legs ride up a little bit, but I guess if you have on some tight clothing, it won't really matter. So let's go ahead and jump right into the clothing. So I went ahead and I paired most of the items up, you know, to give it a little outfit vibe, whatever. You do not have to put these pieces together. It's just something that I just prefer to do to make it easier to give it a little look or whatever. So the first pants I'm gonna show you. These are like um, the little leather look um, pants, but they are super stretchy. Oh my God, these fit so well. I thought they were gonna come and be like the liquid legging looking type. Nah, mm -mm, I wouldn't. I couldn't do that but these are they really feel like pants these were $19 and I got these in a size large and they fit to the T pants I usually get in like mediums um, US sizes or large depending on the fabric but these have a lot of stretch and the thing with Shein you do have to read the reviews on everything to see how everything fits and that's kind of how you can choose your size because everything fits differently on there and they come to a great length at my ankle these pants are so bomb y'all oh my god they do have pockets on the back so i went ahead and paired it with this gorgeous halter neck ruched bodysuit 
Oh my God, this bodysuit is so fire. Oh my God. So it has this halter neck and it has the ruched sleeves that come off the shoulder. The one thing about this, I wish I would have gotten it in a medium. I got it in a large. Um, it is super stretchy, super duper stretchy. So if you do order this, definitely order your right size or you can even size down. It was originally $14, but of course I paid $11.68 for it after the coupon. So that was a steal right there, $11. And this is a great Instagram baddie. If you go for that kind of vibe, you know, girl. Definitely pick this up. All right, so for this next look, I went ahead and got this cropped sweater here. It is long sleeve. I got this in a size large. Um, I wanted an oversized type look, so that's why I went for the large, and it fits perfectly, fits exactly how I wanted to. Um, for this, it's a great basic staple piece. You definitely need a crop sweater with some high waist jeans, and baby, you are on the go, whether you dress it up or dress it down. This was originally $9, and I paid $7.51 for it. Oh my God. And I know, I mean, they're pretty long sleeves, but me, I like to scrunch up sleeves on my crew necks and sweaters, so this is perfect. Now, the jeans that I paired with this, um, they have stretch, but not as much as I would want. I mean, they're not bad, but I kind of like stretchy, stretchy pants, and this has a little bit of stretch. I went ahead and I got these in a size large. Um, I'm not sure if they had an extra large, but I definitely would have gone up a size in these. Um, but they're not bad. They are not bad at all. The ripped detail is very nice. These were originally $20. I got them for $16.68. I mean, I hear people raving over Fashion Nova jeans. I haven't tried them out. I personally have not shopped at Fashion Nova myself. But Shein's jeans, baby, they, they hugs you. They hug you and they hold you in, okay? So definitely don't sleep on she in jeans. Now the only thing I can say I really don't like about these jeans, in the picture, the ankles seem a little bit skinnier. I don't know if I just got skinny ankles or what, but they just weren't as skinny as I would like. So I don't know, you just have to take that into consideration when you're seeing these pants and these items on these models. Definitely look at the pictures and the reviews for more help. Okay, so these next pair of pants, woo, the struggle of getting them on. But once you get them on, they are hot and they do hug every curve that you have and they fit wonderfully. They have a zipper on the side and it has the hook to keep it in so in case the zipper starts to come down, you good. Um, they do have a little bit of stretch to them, not a whole lot of stretch. And I think the problem was the thigh area for me. I have big thighs, so getting them past my thighs is a little struggle, but baby, once you get these on, oh my God. And they do have the split hem on the side, which gives it a better little detailed look there. Love it when they have the split hem. Now on the picture, they look brown. So I was really expecting like a brown pair of pants and these are more of a burnt orange, if you can tell. Um, but it's not a bad color, gray fall color, super cute. These were originally $13 and I paid $10.85, okay? Definitely don't sleep on Shein. And I went ahead and completed this look with this turtleneck shoulder pad top. I've been seeing these shoulder pad tops all over Instagram lately. So I said, let me go ahead and get in on this. Ride this wave, this little trend or whatever. Um, I don't, I don't know how I feel about it. I don't know. I, I, I don't know. Um, <laughs> I mean, it's cute. It is, but it's giving me Power Ranger vibes, you know. Go fight crime. I ain't trying to look like that, sis. But, I mean, I would wear it somewhere. But, it, mm, I, don't, I don't know. Y'all tell me how it looks in the comments. Let me know what your thoughts are on this. What I do like about it, I don't know if you can see it, but it has like these little gold flecks in it. So it's kind of like a shimmer to it. This top was $10. I paid $8.34 for it. So, I mean, it's not bad for, you know, getting a little look, 
little trendy look or whatever. Moving along to the next outfit. Um, I got these pants here. Their pants are kind of short. Like it depends on what kind of pants you get, but these hit me kind of short on my ankle, which I was kind of upset about. But everywhere else, it fits great. And I love, love, love that they have pockets. Um, fits great on the waist. I got these in a size medium. So these were like the only pair that I got in a medium because I was going, of course, along with the reviews. And they fit great. I love it, but I just wish they were a little bit longer. Um, but other than that, these pants were $11 originally and I paid $9.11. Once again, I got these in a size medium. I would say go ahead and get your normal size if you do order these pants. They are really nice. So I went ahead and paired those pants with this marble sheer top. Oh my God, this, this top is hidden, okay? You definitely have to wear like a black bra or a nude bra under it. Um, it is like sheer sheer. If you can see that, see my hand. But it's really cute. It has the lettuce trim on the neck area as well as the arms and at the bottom. Super cute. The only complaint I have with this top is it comes a little short. So you definitely have to wear something that's high waisted if you want to go for that tucked in look. If not, you do assist. But that's just the way I like to wear it. I did get this in a size large. I would suggest you size up in this top because it is a little constricting like on the arm area. It does have a lot of stretch, but it's it's just the way that it's made. So it's a little tight. So go ahead and size up on that. This shirt was originally $6. I paid $5, $5 girl, go and get you one, okay? Okay, first things first, I'm gonna say love, love, love these crocodile embossed leggings. The only thing I don't love about it is in the front area here and the little pouch, it's like so much extra room and it's so baggy and I don't understand if they're making their clothes for somebody with long torsos or what, or do I have a short torso? I don't know, but they are super cute. The only other thing is they are pretty thin, so you have to be careful when you are putting them on. At the bottom on the ankle, they do have the split hem right in the front, which is so cute. This just amps the outfit up so much more. Um, they are a great length. I got these in a size large, so maybe I should have sized down or stuck to my normal size of a medium, but definitely do not order up in these pants. They are so gorgeous though. The print on them scream expensive, okay? And they're not. These pants were originally $10 and I paid $8.29. That's it. You don't have to break the bank to look fire, okay? Now sis, this top is giving me grown and sophisticated with a little youthful flair. Um, it has the cut out shoulder. It is a turtleneck top, full turtleneck, but you of course can roll it down. Long sleeves and the sleeves are long enough um, I found that they're long enough for me. None of the sleeves on any of the tops that I got were short, um, so I think it's suitable for tall girls and people with long arms. This top is so high. I mean, it's nothing, it's really kind of basic, but it's, it's high. I mean, the, the shoulder detail just sets it off all the way. It does have like a rib knit look to it, so. This top was originally $8 and I paid $6.67 for it. And it doesn't feel like it's cheap or anything. I feel like you can wash this and it still would come back to life every time. I did get this in a size large. Now this next top, this may be my favorite item of this whole haul. Oh my God, this is so cute. It's like this corset top and it has balloon puff sleeves here. The sleeves, once again, are really long and this item has stretch to it. Um, it has a zipper on the back, so you know, you don't have to pull it over your head or anything. You just have somebody help it out. It is a little, little struggle if you're doing it by yourself, but I was able to get it on and off by myself. 
Um, the color is gorgeous. It's a chocolate brown, but it has kind of like this holographic effect to it. That's really cute. This top I actually got um, in a Shein order from a couple months ago. So I kind of just threw it in there because I didn't have anything to go with these jeans. But baby, this top was originally $14 and I paid $12.65 for it. I got it in a size large and I, yeah, I do suggest that you size up in this because it fits very exact very exact it's not much room for your boobs so if you have bigger boobs i would not suggest this for you um so yeah this top is so bad now these jeans i do love more than the first pair of jeans because they stretch really really well it is very high waisted it does have the distressing on both legs and the ankles oh my god the ankles get into it how cute is that it has a frayed ankle and it's like a um like a fringe so it's a denim fringe denim distress fringe and it's so cute does have the pockets on the back love these jeans they fit like a glove honestly these jeans were originally $20 I got them for $16.49 I got them in a size large, but honestly, I really could have gone down and got them in a medium because it is a little extra space in the crotch area, but they definitely fit great. I mean, it's you, you really can't tell that it's a little baggy, but sis, if you don't get anything else out of this haul, oh my God, these fishnet leggings, these mesh leggings are so cute. They giving me like, Rihanna vibes or something. So the top that I have on with this, I got it from Walmart. I, I couldn't think of anything else to pair it with. It would look really cute if you had like a long blazer, a long black blazer, um, you know, with some little boy shorts or something under it because they are see-through all over, all the way to the top. They have these little embellishments, these little rhinestones. They're not really rhinestones. They're like, what do you call these? I don't know, but they're not really rhinestones. They're kind of like a little hot fix applique type thing. The only thing I can say about these pants is that they get a little itchy. So these things all over, rubbing all over your body, it's a little itchy, but I mean, if you can stand it for a couple hours or whatever, wherever you're trying to go, it's definitely a hit. They do come down pretty long for me so if you got on heels it won't hit the floor but it's not bad it's not like an ankle pant it does have a good little link to it but i love these i suggest that you definitely go ahead and get these pants so these last four pair of pants i'm just wearing with a regular bodysuit because for some reason i didn't really match up outfits all together i need to stop doing that and go ahead and shop and get outfits all together um, so I got these hounds to print pants. Love, love, love these. Of course, the only objection I have is the too big crotch area right here, but that's my own fault. Um, the review said to size up. I would really stick to my own size if you get these pants. I got these in a size large. They do have the split hem at the bottom, once again, on the side, so that adds a nice little touch to it. They fit great, though, otherwise. Outside of the large crotch area, they definitely fit great. They're super cute. You can add a pop of color if you want for your top. Um, a nice cobalt blue or a red would be really cute with these pants. These were originally $9 and I paid $7.46 for these pants. So it's not a bad buy at all for the price. Next, I got these skinny pants with the sequins on the side. Baby, tell me you are not loving that. Oh my God, how cute. So these, of course, were too big, but I made it work, of course. I got these in a size large. Definitely order these in your regular size. Do not size up. They are super duper stretchy. If I would wear these out, I would wear it with like a white button up. Um, something real cute, but you know, a little formal looking because it has like a tuxedo vibe to me. That's just what it's giving me. I don't know what it's giving you. 
but once again they do not come down that long on me so if you are a tall girl you definitely might want to look into not getting these unless you like that ankle look or if you want to like crocs look these pants were originally $11 and I paid $9.11 these last two pair of pants that I got, they are the same. They are just in different colors. They are some plaid um, ankle pants. Really, really cute. Plain at the bottom. They are a little thin, however, you know, you can get away with it. I wouldn't suggest wearing this in, in the deep of winter because you will freeze your pants off literally. Um, I got these in a size large. I'm glad I did because they are a little bit constricting. If I would have got a medium, they definitely would not have fit on me. Um, I love how this dips low in the front like this. So it definitely accentuates your curves, gives you that little hourglass figure or whatever. These pants were originally $8 and I paid $6.63 for them. And this is just like a little salmon color, a little pink. And like I said, this last pair is the same pair of pants as before, except they are in this yellow. It's giving me very much clueless vibes, which is why I picked these up because that look is so in right now. Clueless, 70s, whatever you wanna call it. These pants, super cute for the price. I would definitely recommend them. Once again, I would size up though because they are a little constricting. So thank you all for watching this haul. Let me know if you wanna see some more of these hauls and where you wanna see them from down below in the comment section. Go ahead and take a moment to subscribe if you haven't done so already. And make sure you thumbs up this video to let me know how much you love this haul. So until next time, Glam Dolls, I just want y'all to stay healthy, stay happy, and stay safe. Bye.